Hello everyone, I'd like to share with you a few trades that were posted on Wednesday, 15th of November 2023. These trades were shared by PM, who is trading Nasdaq CFD. As you see, the macro chart, which was an uptrend due to the news, broke down. And this was seen in the structural chart as a downtrend that you see. So using the one minute trading chart, he identified two areas of entry based on algo 1 to 5 and intercell short position and manage and close them with exit strategy number one with profit. So thank you PM for sharing your trades with us. The next trades were shared by ES who is trading also Nasdaq CFT. As you see the macro chart is in a strong uptrend and we can see the uptrend channel here. So using five minute structural chart we see a complex pullback and this downtrend wave first was identified. So using one minute trading chart, she identified this area of the downtrend pull back and enter one sell short position and manage and close it with setup T based on algo one to five and close it with exit strategy number one with profit. Again, when the price reached the dynamic support area, she entered long position with setup T and manage and close this also with exit strategy number one with profit. So thank you yes, for sharing your trades with us. Next trades were shared by Yan, or global instructor, who is trading Nasdaq CFD. As you see, the macro chart was in uptrend and broke down, and this complex pullback and downtrend wave was identified with five-minute chart as a downtrend. And using a one-minute trading chart, he identified two areas of sell short entry and managed and closed this with exit strategy number one with profit. So thank you, Yan, for sharing your trades with us. The next section is the video that I sent to students yesterday providing an overview of the market because the market was choppy at the beginning and I didn't take any trade due to high volatility. I also didn't have time to take any trades at the end of the market. So you can see this video that was sent to students yesterday and hope that is useful for you. Hello everyone. I'd like to share with you the review of the market today because at the beginning of the market, the market was very choppy and I didn't take any trade and I didn't have time to take any trades at the end of the market. Anyway, the market during the global session was fluctuating above the previous day close and it went up during the London session and during the New York market session because of the Fed member speaking. It was highly volatile at 9.30 with no directions. So when the market is very choppy and non-trendy, we recommend everyone not to take any trades. So I didn't take any trades today at the beginning and didn't have time to take any trades at the end of the market. And as you see, the market is just fluctuating between the previous day close and also high again. So hope this market overview is useful for you and let us know if you have any questions. Have a wonderful day.